channels are the life force energy of the form. You see them in the body graph anytime two harmonic gates are activated. So we call gates harmonic to each other if they're on either end of a channel. For instance, looking at gate 1 in the body graph, its harmonic is gate 8. Looking at gate 2, its harmonic is gate 14. So we would call that the channel 1-8 or the channel 2-14. And of course, these channels have names and other keynotes. Channels are really what a very crucial part of human design analysis of the body graph because they are what brings us consistent life force energy through a consistent, reliable mechanism. In fact, channels give us definition. All human design types except reflectors have at least one channel. Reflectors, by definition, have no channels in their body graph. No, that is to say, no channels activated. Of course, we all have the dormant potentials of experiencing these different channels and so on. But uh, the reflector doesn't have any activated channels. They have no defined centers in their body graph. So what's consistent for them is not the channel, the life force energy consistency, but the lunar cycle. That's what brings consistency to their life, and that's what they can rely on and trust. They can trust that over the course of a lunar cycle, they will come to a correct decision, or at least sometimes multiple lunar cycles, but usually over one lunar cycle, enough time will have passed for the correct decision to emerge. But in the case of the types that are not reflectors, they're going to end up actually relying on one or more channels as their inner authority. And that channel will also give definition, which results in their type, which will also give them their strategy. So channels are very important. I mean, you can look at the channel as basically the life force energy of the person, um, or for the reflector, that they have a flexible, changing life force energy, very um, kaleidoscopic, and that they get to experience different aspects of their life force energy over the course of a lunar cycle. But um, the, the way to really think about channels is that this is what gives you your vitality. That if you're honoring the mechanics of that channel, and by the way, there are different types of channels. There are generator channels, projected channels, as they're called, which are the projector channels. There are manifestor channels. Um, these three different kinds of channels, and then there's other nuances as well, of course. You can describe channels in terms of their circuitry, but even just at the basic level of the type aspect of the channel, if it's a generator channel, it is meant to operate in response. If it's a projected channel, also known as a projector channel, then that is meant to operate through invitation and recognition. And if it's a manifestor channel, then it's meant to operate by informing before taking action. And those are, those are action channels, very much um, you know, about taking action in the world. So depending what kind of channel it is, it's going to have certain mechanics, and obeying those mechanics are what essentially leads to the health of that channel. And you can see this quite visibly, quite literally with people, where their life force energy will be waning, especially in older age. You can tell somebody who's older, but you know, is full of vitality versus someone who's older and doesn't have a lot of vitality. But even in young people, you can find a teenager who just seems lifeless and dull and has no vitality. And then they have a projected channel and someone invites them and suddenly they're recognized and they come to life. Or you can see an, an elder who, you know, is invited and comes to life and suddenly seems 20 years younger. So it really shows that our perception of age has a lot to do with our perception of vitality, and these concepts are often mixed up. But what what they really are what it's saying is that each of us has the potential to be vital well into old age. In order to do this, we have to obey the energy mechanics of our channels.